I need to record today's video, buddy. Come on, I know you don't want to go. I need to play Apex Legends Season 7. All right, come on, buddy. Got this new puppy yesterday and so far he has been stuck to me like glue. He always wants to sit on my lap, but we've got business to take care of today because Apex Legends Season 11 has brought a brand new tropical map. I'm not going to lie, this map is somewhere I'd love to go on holiday. I'm going to be real honest with you guys, I haven't touched Apex Legends in about three months, purely because the game is going to be three years old in February and I typically get bored of video games after about a year or two, but this could be a completely fresh take on Apex Legends. Can't wait to try it out. Here we go. Take a look at this map. Now, this looks absolutely colourful. It looks tropical. I can't wait to jump into it. I don't know where the best places are. Let's go over here. Now, I haven't played this game in about three months. I've got a new dog that's kept me awake all night and it's given me about two hours sleep. So I don't want you guys to expect anything crazy. I do want to find the new gun because uh, the new gun apparently is OP, but we're going to have to wait and see. Oh, we've got the new gun, guys. Here we go. We've got it. You know what? I actually want to use the iron sights for this weapon. Oh, this gun feels good. Okay, it's a Prowler. Nice. This gun feels so good. Titanfall 2 vibes right here, guys. Okay, these things are quite feisty. Okay, are my teammates going to help me here? It'll be so embarrassing going down to these things. I've done, I've done quite a few embarrassing things when playing this game, but going down to Prowlers has to be up there with one of the most embarrassing things to happen in a game of Apex Legends. And we've just completely revealed our location now. You know what? I might just have to keep playing this game again just for this gun. But you can switch ammo types as well. You can switch between light ammo and heavy ammo. Now, this is meant to be some sort of cannon shot here. Meant to just blast you in the air. Let's, let's try it out. See what happens. Oh, baby. Take a look at this. You don't get much movement on this. You can't actually move at all. Once you shoot off... You have to commit to that area. Now, I read somewhere that this map is, I think, 15% bigger than World's Edge. And to be honest, I can see it because I still haven't bumped into any enemies yet. Do any of you guys still play Apex Legends? Be sure to let me know down below. Obviously, the game's been out for a while now. I know quite a few people have sort of drifted off to other games, which, you know, it makes sense because th there's nothing wrong with this game. I think it's just because it's been out for so long. I tend to get bored of playing the same thing over and over again. But to be honest, this map is just a completely fresh breath of air. And it does feel like I'm playing a different game, especially with this new gun as well. Yeah, this gun is definitely my favourite gun in the game. So, zip line here. Come on. Oh, watch this, guys. Oh, that was so close. Okay. Uh, I don't... Oh, this gun is good. I was about to say I don't think it's that good, but the fire rate, you can have any damage on this thing, but the fire rate is always going to make it OP. Look how long these zip lines are. That's what I like to see. Fast traveling. I know I'm probably going to sound weird saying this, but I actually like this gun without any sights on it at all. I just like the iron sights, the natural way this gun is. Come on, how long do thermites last? Go. Oh my god, I feel sorry for that guy. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, I still haven't lost it with the wingman. I have not lost it with the wingman. Don't worry, I got it. I got it under control. There we go, I told you. There's no need to panic. There's no need for my teammates to leave. Now, there have been 36 Battle Royales to ever launch. There are probably more than 36, but there are 36 licensed Battle Royales that have launched. And out of them 36 Battle Royales, I still think Apex Legends is the best Battle Royale right now to be playing. And I want to explain why. In terms of the experience that you still get with Apex Legends, I truly think that no other game can offer what Apex Legends offers. In terms of, you know, the gameplay, the, the creativity with play styles. Any play style you have, this game can adapt and cater to it. And now that the game has more DLC Legends than original Legends that launched with the game, I do think that that has just widened the play style and opportunities. Now, I don't want to compare 
compare this game to any other game because obviously everyone has their preferences. But the reason why I don't like certain games, I mean, I'll, I'll give Warzone as, good ex as a good example, is because the skill ceiling is a little bit low in that game. Let's say, for example, you get caught out in the open. There's not much you can do. Bad players can kill good players fairly often. You can run over someone in a building that's got ghosts. There's a lot of camping involved. And there's nothing you can do. If you're caught out in the open, no matter how good you are, you're probably going to get killed. But this game, no matter what situation you're in, you can always try and make something out of it. And that's why I absolutely love this game. But this game isn't too advanced so that casual people can't have fun. Similar to Hive Escape. Hive Escape was so advanced that you, you kind of had to be a really good player or you just wouldn't enjoy that game at all. This game caters to, to all kinds of people. But even the ranked mode is truly uh, unbelievable. This game's almost three years old, as I mentioned earlier. Although I'm not enjoying it as much, that's not down to the game itself. That's just because of how long the game's been out for. I do still think this is the best Battle Royale on the market. And even Nick Merckx, one of the biggest streamers, said himself that Apex Legends is the best battle royale to be playing right now. And that's coming from someone that has been playing Warzone religiously since it came out. Take a look at it. This map is honestly, I know I've said it before and you guys are probably getting bored of me saying it. If you haven't played it on the new map, I suggest you guys try it out. That's another thing I love as well is that there's still 10 squads left. Usually on Kings Canyon or World's Ed right now, there'll probably be like seven squads left. I'm sure you guys watching have been in that game where there's about two squads left and the ring is still absolutely huge. You're just going around trying to find the last team. I still can't believe there's been 36 Bass Royale to launch. And I, I don't know that fact. I just found it on Wikipedia. I haven't actually played every single battle royale there are probably more than 36 battle royales probably from some indie studios i didn't know there were that many battle royales that's kind of crazy when you think about it okay there's there's an invisible wall or something there those guys just dipped faster than anything oh man i nearly got in there i nearly done him nearly oh this game Do you know what? I'm just choking everything right now. No way. They just left. They left me. That's something that doesn't change with this game, is that random teammates just leave. I understand why they left, to be honest, because I'm probably going to die myself, but that's not the point. This just feels... It just doesn't feel good. You know when you were a kid and you loaded up on Call of Duty Zombies on your own in a solo match and you just, you're just you just so scared to play it? That's how I feel right now. We're going to go up from behind. I'll be stupid to fight this right now. It's only me. I'm, I'm the only one left against a team of three here. Come on, now's no time to push. Oh, we knocked one. We knocked two. Yeah, there we go. That, that's how you play solo in this game, guys. I'm so screwed right now. <gasps> I'm so screwed. I'm so dead. There's nothing I could have done in that situation. Come on, man. This game right now, season 11 has definitely brought back that fun element for me. Be sure to check it out if you haven't already, guys. I'm going to wrap this video up here. Thank you all for watching this video. Enjoy the rest of your day. And as always, I'll catch all of you guys out in another brand new video. Take care.